My name is Siwa Msangi. I'm a researcher in the Environment and Production Technology Division at IFPRI. And the Biosite project is a project that looks at the complexity around sustainable intensification and helps researchers assess the trade-offs between environmental sustainability and farmer livelihoods. Well, climate smart agriculture is a topic of intense interest at the moment because we're thinking a lot about climate policy and the effects that future climate change is going to have not only on agriculture but on every other sector of the economy. So our partners in the CGIR, uh, such as the program on policies, institutions and markets and the program on climate change and food security has been looking at the question of what kind of technologies can be focused at helping farmers be more resilient to climate. Sustainable intensification of agriculture and the climate proofing or making agriculture climate smart really are uh, in many ways the same thing because we're talking about preserving the natural resource base upon which agriculture heavily relies such as the health of soils, the sustainability of water and how we use water and capture it for agriculture as well as the management of nutrients that can either come from um, inorganic fertilizers or naturally from uh, the environment or from let's say livestock or other crop residues. If you make agriculture more resilient to climate stress, more resilient also to stresses from the economic environment, you're making farmers better off and you're making them better able to withstand any type of shock in the future, whether it comes from climate or not. By promoting the sustainability of agriculture and promoting the sustainability of the resource base upon which agriculture depends, we're actually meeting a lot of the other uh, environmental goals that the UN and other bodies have set forth in their development programs going forward. I would love to see our work having a really strong influence on the way decision makers think about sustainable intensification of agriculture. Our tools and our methodology can be used to help decision makers actually evaluate what the costs and benefits are of adopting one type of strategy over the other. We hope that you'll enjoy this site and that you'll send us any feedback or thoughts that you have on our research as we welcome collaboration from others.